Hello guys, welcome to my quarterback, Road to Glory, Week 2 versus the Missouri Tigers, and I'll resume this commentary when my first play be my well my first clip begin. Alright guys, the first couple quarters, like the first and second, about half the third, really had troubles trying to pass the ball against the Missouri defense. The pass rush, the blitzing, they do that a lot. As you can see in the first play of the game, I actually get a decent scramble, but I think that's the only run play you'll actually see me do. I, I really kind of focus on passing the ball this game. But, you know, fast forward, actually, I think this is the same exact play after, where, you know, I get, you know, throw up. An interception, you know, not the best, you know, choice to the receiver, but, you know, starting off the game a little rocky, you know, after just throwing an interception. Fast forward to the second quarter, about 4 minutes and 30 seconds left. I actually throw a really nice uh, ball to my wide receiver on the sidelines, and he brings it in, and he doesn't go out of bounds. He runs for about 5 yards, and, you know, that's a pretty good game. I think that's my first completion, and we're in the second quarter, so, you know, as you can tell, I really haven't, you know, been on the spot. You know, I throw it to my tight end. He gets us the first down. And you know it really helped us because you know we're down 16 to zero, you know. So we really need, just need all the yards we can get here. I mean, this game comes down to a you know a pretty uh a pretty good ending. I mean, it is a it has a pretty good ending. You know, not for us, but you know, but you know, as you saw, my wide receiver just you know caught a really like a eight uh, ball for about eight yards, I think. And this is the drive. I really put together put together these drives at the end of the game. And that was just one. I really like, you know, this play I have up about the slants, like the big huge things going across the middle of the slants. And the defense, you know, the coverage was pretty good. I keep on just hitting the wide receiver over and over again. You know, that might have not been the best throw there, but I just keep on, you know, just calm the play, just getting up to the line, hiking the ball, throwing it downfield. And, you know, this is a drive I really put together. Get a lot of yards here, but we are still down 23-0. to zero. We're just really trying to get a touchdown here as a throw ball. He actually brings it in. And we are first and goal here, trying to do another, um, you know, just bring it up to the line, just hurry it up. And I think I get a pass to my wide receiver to the outside here, or, oh no, I throw it to my wide receiver, but he dives over, but I let him too far over the end zone, and he just brings it up out of bounds. We do get zero after getting there, not a turnover, just a missed field goal by my kicker. You know, that really frustrates us, but, you know, or me. But, you know, we'll get more points. That's a sort of my tight end for about eight, seven yard gain. And, you know, third quarter, about almost a minute left. We're down 23 to 0. Really needing to turn on, put up, well, put up some points on the board. Just, you know, as I throw it to my wide receiver, just gets in with the one foot. That was a really good pass by me. I thought he might be leading him, so I just chucked it up there for him, as you can see in the replay right here. I thought that he had the safety beat, so I just through it and he brings it down just barely gets one foot I thought he wouldn't bring the foot down but he's able to you know and that will get us up on the board I think yeah we do go for two here but you know we can't get it on the jet sweep I don't know why we run that play to get a two-point version but you know what can you do is we now it's a fourth quarter throw it to my wide receiver over the middle he will bring it in all right there's about four minutes and 30 35 seconds left and you know, gonna hike the ball, drop back, and third and ten. You know, really need this conversion to keep the drive alive. Not the best pass, but you know, he does tackle him in bounds, and that is a very, you know, that's a good play by me. And here we go, trying to put some points up on the board, looking for my wide receiver on the out route, and I will hit him just enough for the touchdown, and that will bring us up to 14 points as we did. I did get a successful two point conversion. I don't know. Well, I think we just hit both the field goals. But that our defense does hold Missouri. So it's 23-14. Really trying to throw a ball. Not that I thought that was going to get deflected or just, 
you know, the intercepted, as you can see my stats there, you know, I'm not the best. I, you know, I threw an intercepted, I think I was 13 for 27. I might, uh, I can't really remember. But driving back here, about three minutes left, the same as that play after. Throw it to my wide receiver string across the middle of the field that will get us the first down and, you know, some much needed, needed yardage. So here we go. I think we're in a little bit of field goal range, but, you know, we just get, we need points, but, you know, preferably touchdowns, you know. We're running out of time here. Throw it to my tight end on that edge. He will get the first down and get out of bounds, which is a very good job by him, as you can see when he do a run play, and I just kind of skip it. You know, don't really want to, you know, show those. I mean, I mean, I'm not really involved in that play. But same play after about two minutes and 25 seconds left. Just gets sacked here. You know, not a good job by well by me and my defense, uh, my offensive line. You know, blocking in this game, it's it's all right. But you know, that's more of my fault by me. Here I throw it to my wide receiver on the out route, going out. And this is where I said we could have. I think we scored a touchdown, but we keep on running run plays here. We don't have any timeouts. I should have just. Double tap of watch, we can go back to the line and play that play again, but we just run the ball constantly here. We have run after run after run. I don't know why we're doing this. We could have actually gotten into the end zone and scored, but actually skipped that play. We run another run play here, just skipping that. I just don't know why we're running the ball. I mean, that is, see, we lost the game because the offensive coordinator is really going to make us run the ball. And I can't audible out. I can't do anything. I'm just stuck there. But, you know, this game's wrapping up. We lose 23-17, to and, you know, a decent game. I mean, I think we got 300 and something passing yards. You know, got sacked a couple times, you can see here. Actually, kind of running away, actually get a safety. They actually get a safety on me. and yeah, that was a bad play by me, but, you know, what you can get, what you can get. And, you know, next week, I think we are at Illinois, and the week after, I think we're playing USC, so that's when we actually start our conference games. But, you know, this is commentary dropping up, and I will see you guys either in the next Dynasty Week 3 or uh, Road to Glory Week 3. Alright, guys, I'll see you then. And, you know, thanks for watching. And, you know, I almost have 10 subscribers. Really, thank you guys for watching and subscribing to me. But I'll see you in the next commentary.